Pisces, welcome to your weekly forecast. This is for June 30th until July 6th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Well, you'll be procrastinating this week. And there's also a decision that you will be regretting that you have made. Alright, Pisces, you will try to do your best to, you know, um, to create an impression when it comes to your workplace. And you are thinking, you know, or you will be dreaming about winning because there is um, like a brand new opportunity or like a position that you're applying for or there is something that you are really aiming for to have and to get. And... You will also be talking or back in touch with some of the people around your workplace, you know, to, let's just say, to get close or try to get close and get their vote, okay? Now, you will be, you will try to make friends around your workplace, but then the more you try harder, some people try to push you away because they know what is your intention and they know what you're up to. Now, there is somebody that you will be confiding to or that you will be, like, venting out. And it seems like, you know, this person can only do, like, listen to you and not really give you any sound advice. But you know what? You know, um, having someone to listen to you will be a very good help. And it will also be, you know, uh, it will be making a difference. Now, by, by the middle of the week, you will be very happy. Because all of your hard works, that even though there are some people who will, be, who will try to push you away and who will try to, you know, um, disdain you or try to put you down, you will be very happy because the management will be giving you that go signal or that green signal. And for you, will be like, you know, like you'll be breathing that sigh of relief and finally, you know, like, oh my God, I thought I'm not going to get it, but then finally... You know, so you will be very thankful and you will also be like finally having that good night's sleep. Now, you will try to find yourself right, right in the middle of a lost journey. And you feel so lost right now without any further guidance. And instead of focusing on your work and focusing on your productivity, you will be indulging a little bit and you'll be doing the things that... <clears throat> You shouldn't be doing in the first place. Now, don't shop or don't spend too much this week uh, with your um, family and friends just to, you know, give them some treat or just to make them happy because it will just wound you or it will just uh, hurt you by the end of the week. And it seems like it will also reopen some of the wounds of the past with your, uh, could be children, relatives or siblings. And you feel like I have tried to do everything that I can to, you know, to get close to you and for you to be nice to me. But then this is all I ever got always from you. Now, you're also starting to think if you should move into a bigger city or if you should move into a bigger environment or bigger, you know, bigger area. You will also be consulting an oracle by the end of this week. And, you know, just to have a reassurance of your future that everything will be okay. Now, you'll also be pampering yourself and try to relax because you don't want to cram or you don't want to overthink and uh, overanalyze things. So you just want to calm your energy. You just want to prepare for the big day next week and you will be you know, receiving a uh, visitor, an, an unexpected visitor that will be coming your way this weekend. And 
It seems like there will be a brand new beginning with somebody as well that you have been trying to push away. It seems like this is either an earth sign or a fire sign. Okay. And you will also be surprised that, you know, that this person, even if you have tried to push them away, they will still be, <clears throat> they will still be around you. All right. Now, for those who's looking for a new job or a new position, it seems like you'll be getting a very good indication that you will be getting the job. Okay. Some of you will also be moving to a new place or a new house, and you will be making that brand new start <clears throat> out from the old place that you used to be in. And try to avoid this toxic water sign that will still be coming your way and or be back in touch with you. All right. If you can just shield yourself away from their energy, better. All right. <clears throat> I also feel like you will be coming to a head-to-head -head argument with somebody who is either a fire or air sign around your workplace. And this person doesn't really believe in your strength. Okay. This is a guy. And this person will be, will try to measure you, will try to test you, or will try to see, you know, whatever you got. And if, you know, if they, they just wanted to see how far can you go and what can you do to be competitive. But the truth is, this person seems to be so um, insecure of you. And they're also insecure that you might just take their position someday. Okay? Um, this person is so hard to please. And they're very nasty, bully. And they're also very, uh, what do you call this? Um, not really bully, but very strict, and it's so hard for them to believe that there are some people who's actually better than them, you know? So, you will manage to get the best out of that professional relationship, but for now, stop impressing other people because they know what the, you're up to. All right, just be yourself. Do, do it naturally, because eventually you will be getting that, um, getting the position, getting the job, or getting the job done. You know, you'll be winning the competition. So don't worry, and the higher management or your boss will be backing you up. That's a good thing. All right. Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Pisces. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live at the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.